When debugging JavaScript, sometimes you just want to be notified when a given function is called or what a value is at a specific point in time. People will often add console log statements to achieve this, but you can use log points to achieve much of the same thing without modifying your original program. To demonstrate this, here I'm debugging a simple express application in VS Code. And let's say that I wanted to have a message that is printed whenever I, I request the index page of this uh, server here. I'm going to create a log point just by going into the gutter and saying right click and saying add log point here. And now I'm adding a log point. Log points behave much like breakpoints, but instead of stopping the execution of the program, they print a message out whenever this log point is hit. You can both print out text and then also evaluate expressions and have the results printed to the console. So let's print out something like the current time. So I'm going to print the string time and then the JavaScript expression. I'm going to, uh, JavaScript expressions are inside of these uh, braces here. I'm going to print the current uh, value from date now and just hit enter. And now I've created a log point. Now if I go and I request the page on my server, so the index page here, and I switch over to the debug console, you'll see that the time is being printed. If I request it again, the new time is being printed, so it reevaluated that JavaScript expression. You can edit the log point by right-clicking on it and saying edit log point. And let's use a more complicated one here. So now it's um, using a more complicated expression, so it's getting the uh, user agent header from the request. I'll hit enter again to save that and make another request here. And now it's printing out the user agent along with the current time. You can also disable log points. So I'm just going to temporarily disable this if we want to make some requests and maybe that was too much information was being printed there and then re-enable it again later on. So they work just like breakpoints in that way. So log points are a great way to investigate a program without actually modifying it. So instead of adding a console log statement, consider using log points instead.